Say something along the lines of, let me see if I've heard you correctly. Or do you know exactly what I'm asking you to do? You're checking understanding with the person. You could paraphrase as well, couldn't you? You could paraphrase, yeah. But what we're doing here is checking the understanding. Because you're checking that they understand exactly what you mean. Yeah. You checked understanding with me yesterday when you asked uh, toward the end of the night, I need the bus number. You're checking understanding with me. Yeah. yeah because I, and I had to check back with you as well to say, okay, are we okay? We'll be okay with this now. Yeah. So it's all about that checking understanding. Right, now, both sender and receiver. Remember for your assessment paper, sender and receiver to check. Me personally, I'm the other way around. If, for example, now, there's been uh, an argument being caused, or two people have come together and have started to have a fight or have an altercation, I always say everybody is reachable. Therefore, if you haven't understood me, I always blame myself. Regardless of what this person may have been thinking, regardless of whether he wanted to cause an argument or have a fight or have a premeditated thought in his mind, I always say to myself, it's my fault, because I didn't check in with him. If I didn't reach him, it's my fault. Yeah, that's what I say. So it's just one of my philosophies that I've, I've adopted. Yeah, two Asian guys uh, in a wedding go into the kitchen, kitchen area. These are some of the kabaddi players, uh, parents. I went into the kitchen area. I said, What are you doing in the kitchen? Can't stay in here. The guy starts swearing at me. I turn around and say, Okay, look, all the waiters are there. And it was, it was dirty. Asian swearing. I went out, stood by my posting, I ignored him, I just went out. I was very angry though, but I went out. He came out back out to me. By that time it was about five, six minutes had passed. Put my arms on both of them, on the shoulders. You know who I am. I don't know who you are. By the way, is it your son's wedding? Yes. Okay then, so I'm here to make sure that everything runs smoothly and that nobody goes in the kitchen and ruins your son's wedding. That's why I'm here, explaining my role to him. And he says, I'm really sorry. He had a bit to drink. I said, I didn't know who you was. I asked you to leave the kitchen area because I didn't know who you was. And you're not supposed to be in there. So all I'm doing is my job. And he goes, brother, we're very sorry about this. So I turned him around. However, I was very angry in the moment that could have led to yeah. a physical altercation.